Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Token Post interview. Today we have invited Mr. Vadim Galib, the Vice President of Global Business Development in Crypto Robotics. Welcome. Thank you so much for having me here. <laughs> so could you give a bit of a brief introduction about yourself? Absolutely. Well, um, as, as, you, as you mentioned, I'm a VP for Global Business Development at Crypto Robotics. And what I do at the team is I'm in charge of all the global partnerships. And I'm very pleased to be here. I'm very proud to be to represent Crypto Robotics here in South Korea because here we have our first partnership, our first international partnership. And uh, the Korea uh, is the first country we are taking our product globally. We start with Korea. So from your perspective, Korea was a priority, right? Definitely. What was. brought you to Korea? Actually, it was in consensus where I met Andy Shin from KeyChain. Oh. <laughs> yes, I met him here, um, and actually he introduced me to Chris, and that's how it started. So how you, how you like in Korea so far? How you like the vibe on that, the whole blockchain? That's community? that's that's amazing. <laughs> Honestly, that's amazing, and uh, I'm not talking only about the blockchain community. I'm also talking about the country itself because mm -hmm. it's it's it's. First of all, so much different mm -hmm. from what I've experienced so far in my life. Mm -hmm. It's um, absolutely amazing country. Uh, <laughs> mobile penetration level is so huge. Everyone has smartphones here. Mm -hmm. And the crypto penetration level is so huge as well. Mm -hmm. There are so many people of different ages, of different uh, backgrounds, professional backgrounds, uh, who are interested in crypto and in uh, blockchain. And that's why I'm now more and more reassured that it's a perfect place to bring our product to a global community. <laughs> so moving on to your product, yes. what is Crypto Robotics and what product do you guys uh, priority, I mean, do you guys develop? Well, um, we have developed already a software solution, a software front-end solution for trading mm -hmm. that allows you to trade on, at the moment, 10 major um, cryptocurrency exchanges. Mm -hmm including Binance, Bitthumb, Local One, OKEx, and many others. Uh, and it allows you to do your trading, also to do your technical analysis, because we have more than 50 indicators. Mm -hmm. And also we allow you to place custom orders, like simultaneous stop loss and take profit, mm -hmm. which is not available, for example, on many exchanges, but mm -hmm. we bring it in and we are doing it with our computing power. So from the perspective of your customers or users, they are able to engage in your software and place orders to gain profit? Absolutely. We are already on the, beta, on the public beta stage, so the product is, is available to download and use it. Mm -hmm. And uh, yes, that's what you can do. You can place your orders, you can do your technical analysis, so you can somehow you can multiply your profits, at least in, <laughs> in, in crypto, because we all know that crypto to fiat is, is situation is not that good at the moment. But I hope it, it will change. Um, but what is most important mm -hmm. about our product, we are aiming to uh, enter into the um, market of both amateurs and professional traders mm -hmm. and bring them a very convenient, user-friendly product that will streamline their user experience. Because it's, it will be very easy. You will just switch between different exchanges in one click, mm -hmm. between different tabs in one window. It's not like you have to open 10 exchanges now. Mm -hmm. It will be all in one window. And with all the technical analysis indicators, with the custom orders. Mm -hmm. But the most important thing about it is free of charge. It's freemium product. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> so do you guys provide any portfolio management services? Well, um, it's not like we are providing the portfolio management services, mm -hmm. but uh, we are providing actually tools to automate your trading. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, that's why we called Crypto Robotics, because we monetize and our business model is to develop and sell robots, algorithmic trading bots. Mm -hmm. We already have two ready, two robots ready, and we are deploying them, I hope, next week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And so, yes, that will be something that you can use to totally automate your trading. Mm -hmm. You just allocate a certain uh, budget towards the bot, you choose the strategy, you put some parameters, mm -hmm. you choose the exchange that will trade on, mm -hmm. and it starts trading on your behalf. Mm -hmm. And from our testing, from our testing that we have just finished, within the 33 hours, just think about it, mm -hmm. within the 33 hours, mm -hmm. our robot made 41,000 transactions. Transactions, whoa. Yeah, so that's not something you can do with your hands. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. 
And uh, since you're a software development, I'm pretty sure statistics results are very important. So do you have any statistics to back many about profitability about your right. platform? Right. Out of these 41,000 transactions, mm -hmm. the robot uh, closed 30 transactions with profit of average 1.3%. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah. So if you extrapolate this 1.3% to a month, that will give you around 100%. It's only 33 hours, right? Yes. <laughs> so maybe like 15% in, in just a month, right? Maybe more. <laughs> so <laughs> you guys, you mentioned about uh, providing mm -hmm. a services to uh, customers, amateur investors, and maybe some professional investors. However, do you have solutions for businesses, enterprises as well? Yes, we do. Uh, well, um, thank you for this question because it's, 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 it's really important. We are now, uh, what we've realized because uh, there are some of our early investors, funds that who are interested in having a special service of level, level of service, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and we have developed a special, uh, we are actually right now developing a, something special for them, which we call Enterprise Edition. We have realized that some of the solutions that we were developing um, they are actually more useful for institutions. Mm -hmm. And we are now developing a multi-user um, version, multi-account that will allow you to have different statistics for like management statistics to mm -hmm. see the whole institution, how it performs. And uh, so the, the, the platform could be installed and used as a, ba as a main instrument for trading mm -hmm. within the institution. And we also developed some, several robots for them, like order ex execution robot, which allows you to um, execute large lots without affecting the market price mm -hmm. without and doing it in, in the most efficient way. So you will have your 1,000 Bitcoin sold without really affecting too much the market price. I'm curious to ask, uh, when it comes to crypto, its volatility is a big issue. Exactly. Uh, people hesitate from investing because they don't know what's going to happen in an hour even. So you mentioned, you explained about uh, how you don't touch the manage the fluctuation of the changes. Mm -hmm. How you guys tackle that software-wise? Well, basically, um, as we say, for a trader, fluctuation is good. Mm -hmm. it, uh, for an investor, obviously, the fluctuation is something they are worried about. But for a trader, for it's a, a good trader. It's a chance for a profit gain, right? Absolutely, mm -hmm. absolutely. The more the volatility there are, Mm -hmm. the better it is. And uh, also uh, in terms of, there are more risks associated with, uh, I'd say, with just in general uh, with the crypto in terms of people are afraid of uh, investing mm -hmm. and just afraid of uh, using different tokens because they're and afraid of using different applications mm -hmm. because of the um, security reasons. Mm -hmm. And um, from this perspective, there, is, um, there are a number of things that we have done. Mm -hmm. First of all, we are software developers, as you mentioned, and I do entirely subscribe with this. We are not a financial institution ourselves. We are providing a front-end solution. Mm -hmm. So we do not touch your money. Mm -hmm. And even, even from our platform, you cannot withdraw your money. You have to have a, your own account with the exchange, mm -hmm. and then you have to connect it to our solution, mm -hmm. and then you can trade. But even if you don't have an account with, a, with an exchange, mm -hmm. you still can see and do the technical analysis of for, a, for other exchanges that are available through our platform. Mm -hmm. And I hope by the end of this year, we'll have like 30 major crypto exchanges and we'll cover basically like 90% of the whole market. <laughs> I'm looking very forward to seeing crypto robotics expand to Korea as well. Today, you are here at Blockchain Open Forum. It's our first day and it's the afternoon. Mm -hmm. What's your take on our event? Well, that's, that, that's, that's pretty amazing, I'd say. <laughs> Especially, I love the part when we had the lunch on the private chain hall. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you know, I've, th that's the first time I see it like, because you know, you don't have to, you, you don't have to uh, lose your time there. Uh, <laughs> and actually, the, the selection of speakers mm -hmm. is very good. Mm -hmm. And also other, um, because there was some, there was some, some uh, preceding events like yesterday, there was a Bitfury and K-Chain meetup, which yes. was amazing. Mm -hmm. Honestly, very interesting. Mm -hmm. And uh, um, I'm sure today's speakers are very good. And from the technical perspective, the organization is very good. Mm -hmm. You do have like 
top level technologies here <laughs> and uh, I love the selection of the projects here. So if we open Blockchain Open Forum Season 2 next year, will mm -hmm. you be taking part in that? Definitely, <laughs> especially because I believe will be something significant on Korean market. Mm -hmm. And I do believe that and I trust that we now have perfect partners here. <laughs> yes, yes. And I hope that our partnership will be fruitful. <laughs> and uh, the, because we understand that for to penetrate Korean market, we couldn't do it on our own. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not something that you could do without understanding the specifics and mentality. Mm -hmm. And when I came here, I realized that we were absolutely right about that. <laughs> because I, I, but I love this country, but mm -hmm. it's totally different from anything I had in my life. <laughs> but I, I hope, love it. I hope Crypto Robotics expands to Korea and perform well in this market as well. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in. That was Mr. Fadim Khalib, the Vice President for Global Business Development of Crypto Robotics. Thank you for watching. Thank you.